Hi! In this VR Builder tutorial, we are taking a look at the rotate around axis behavior, which is used to rotate objects or orbit them around other objects. In this case, we will use it on a screw to rotate it while it enters a plank of wood. Let's get started. I prepared a basic VR Builder scene where I added a wooden plank, a screw model, and a transformer which represent where the screw will have to be at the end of the animation. With just these elements, we can move to the workflow editor and start building our animation. I create a new step and call it Animate Screw. Now I want to add two behaviors to this step. The first one will be an animate transform behavior, which will move the screw from its current position to inside the wood. So let's select the screw and its final position. Let's take four seconds for this animation. Okay, now let's add a second behavior to rotate the screw. This is a rotate around axis behavior, and uh, we need to reference uh, the screw as an object here. But we cannot reference the same screw that we referenced it in the animate transform behavior because this kind of transform based uh, animations uh, are mutually exclusive, so they would fight with, it, with each other and one of the two would not be displayed. What we can do is reference a child object. Now we can see the screw. Here is an empty object and the model is a child to it. So if we reference this object instead, we will have the parent that is animated inside the wood and the child that rotates. And the animation can be combined together this way. It wants a rotation axis provider. This can be another game object. The object rotates around. Oh, it could orbit something else, for example, or yeah, or rotate around an arbitrary center. In this case, we want the screw to rotate on itself, so we can leave this empty and the screw will be used as the center of rotation. We must also choose which axis the screw will rotate on, and we can see from the axis here that the Z axis is the one that goes longitudinally through the screw, so it's the one we want to rotate on. Let's match the duration of the other behavior so that they last the same amount of time. And let's have the screw have five or so revolutions on itself. Putting something like 2000 degrees here should work fine. Now if we want to we can edit the animation curve and Right now, it will start animating slowly, then go faster, and then slow down at the end. For the sake of this tutorial, let's change it to something different. I can use another preset curve here. This curve will start fast, so it will screw in faster, and then slow down as it tightens at the end. Now, it would be more natural if this curve was matched also on the other animation behavior, so we can change the position curve here to be the same and now we can try out our animation by pressing play and this is it for this tutorial i hope this helped you and i encourage you to check out our other tutorials and to join our community on discord if you haven't done so already bye